In this video, we're just going to look at how to create a bibliography using Zotero in the SPL format. And so very simply, I've selected a couple sources. Whenever you make a paper, I encourage you to make a collection and add those sources to the collection. So this, if I was going to go to my dissertation research, you know, I have over 500 items there that I have available to cite. But for this video, I've thrown some of those into the Zotero STS video. So here I have 15 sources. And in order to create a bibliography of these items, what I end up doing is I just uh, control A selects all of them. And you can right click and create bibliography from items. And here you get to decide what citation style and we want to use SPL. And here, make sure you select copy to clipboard and you have bibliography selected. Okay, so now it's copied to your clipboard. Then you go to your file and here's, uh, make sure you have it labeled and everything. Okay, so now I'm gonna do bibliography. You can do control V or paste it, um, just paste it in. Now, <clears throat> if you, just click paste. You want to make sure that it's pasted as keeping the source formatting because it's sourcing from Zotero. And if you do merge formatting or keep text only, it's going to change things, especially keep text only. So keep source formatting. Now here you have the just the raw output. And you'll notice that looking at <clears throat> the example, you want uh, double spaced between entries for the bibliography and this should be all caps uh, so in order to double space then you just go through and you just put double spaces in between but you notice that it pretty much a, it has done all the hard work for you oops there you go it's alphabetized everything so it's made things really easy. I'm going to zoom out just a little bit from each one to compare to show you that it's pretty much the same. Notice that it's obviously the big point is you have to put things in the right way in order to get the output the right way. But you have here a uh, very, uh, very similar. I'm not seeing any examples where it would be different necessarily. So this is a super easy way. Obviously, you should double check everything with the examples that are provided with Dr. Coberly's paper and everything. But uh, there is a lot of work that's taken out of it if you just use the system this way. So uh, <clears throat> notice that Notice that everything seems to be checking out. So anyway, that uh, that is how you can save a lot of time and just create your bibliography that way and end up um, having some extra time to go, go out to eat or something or actually get some sleep. Who knows? Anyway, hope that's helpful to you and we'll see you later.